How are you feeling now that exams are over? It's great. I love the freedom that I've now got, but I worked hard to get this freedom. The exams weren't easy by any means, but it's really worth it. Yeah, it was worth the effort we put in, wasn't it? What about your dissertation? What did you enjoy about writing your dissertation? Uh, I definitely enjoyed the practical side of it, so I uh, took a more organic uh, route in chemistry and studied diketoperazines. I thoroughly enjoyed it. What about yourself? I went down a more of a formulation route. I made some sun creams, tested them against short bulk sun creams and their UV protection, their rayology, so seeing how the cream would move underneath a certain amount of stress and the texture of them. I really enjoyed using new instrumentation that I haven't used throughout my degree so far. So with that being said, what was the main highlight of your whole degree? The whole time you've been here, what was your most favourite thing? There wasn't one specific uh, thing that I enjoyed. I enjoyed the journey. Um, University of Greenwich has been very, very helpful in terms of growing as a human being as well as growing with knowledge in chemistry. I'm very different to how I was at 18 years old when I came in year one. And uh, now at 22, I feel like I've um, definitely grown um, in confidence and in intelligence. And um, I've got the University of Greenwich to thank for my, my progress and journey. Um, amazing lecturers, very, very intelligent and experts in their field. Um, I've got an amazing atmosphere of fellow students around me, uh, as well as the facilities on offer, like the library and the student hub, the accommodation is fantastic, as well as all of the lecture rooms. What do you think? Well, the degree and everything has been incredible, but taking the degree out of the University of Greenwich has made me grow as a person, not just in academic fields, but in personal fields, things that are gonna help me in later life. Learning how to cook, clean, budget myself from moving out of home at 18, and then coming to university is gonna help me so much in the future. Also with that, I've gained friends and peers that will hopefully always be in my life, people that have helped me through four years, which have been difficult, but have now been worth it. Yeah, definitely. And uh, I've had the best of both worlds, I guess, because I've lived uh, on campus for the past couple of years, as well as living at home and commuting. Um, so I've had the best of both worlds there. Both are, um, both are, both are good. Um, staying on campus is definitely uh, recommended for, for me personally because you've got everything where you need everything where you need them locally um, as well as you you get yourself outside of your comfort zone it's always good to leave your hometown and um, that's that's how I felt you know what really is good about staying on campus as well if you've got a nine o'clock lecture you can just run out of bed at 10 to 9 and still be there on time yeah yeah exactly exactly I completely agree um, what uh, opportunities have you experienced as a student at University of Greenwich? There's so many opportunities. You've got the Student Hub where they've got all of their sports clubs, societies. I've been a president of a sports club for years. You can also get involved with the academic side and help with open days, help shape minds of the future, help them choose what they want to do for their career maybe, or what university they might want to go to, what they might want to study, and that feeling of knowing that you might just help a person that little bit really helps. Travelling on open days is definitely the way to find out what Absolutely. you're interested in. So uh, what was your favourite module or what did you enjoy learning the most while at university? Well, I have a couple. Um, I've definitely enjoyed instrumental analysis. We've got lots of fantastic instruments and uh, techniques available yeah. and I find that fascinating especially with the, the expense behind it. These machines aren't cheap and it's, I think it's fascinating to have access to such wonderful equipment. Yeah. So uh, in terms of uh, your, your views, what was your favourite type of chemistry, favourite area? I pretty enjoyed all of it. I mean one of the final year modules was in organic materials analysis which was really interesting to see how the chemicals that we all know about, how they actually sometimes either work in the body or how they work in glasses and stuff like that. It's fascinating yeah. how they come into everything. So how was your adjustment from school life to university life? At school it was very uh, sort of, you should do this and you should do that and you should do this, whereas at university, you, you go to the classes, you go to the labs, 
But then what you do with that outside of the university is up to you. That work then has to be your own work, your own free reading to help you consolidate that knowledge. Whereas at school, it was very much a taught syllabus. It's like this, 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 this. Yeah. Whereas at university, you have to consolidate that information outside of the lecture theatres. Yeah. So you're, at university, you're more in control of your own learning. Yeah, it's guided, but it's not guided to the point where it's completely, this is a structure that you have to follow. Yeah. Absolutely, I agree. Uh, I think I had a similar experience in terms of school to university yeah. transition. Um, I was very excited to come to university, I couldn't wait, and it's definitely been a very rewarding journey for me. Yeah. I think um, it's been rewarding for me as well. As much as I was excited to come to university, it's a change in life. It was, it was really scary at yeah. the start, coming here to start off with. I was like, am I going to like meeting, it? Am I going to enjoy it? Meeting loads of new yeah. people, but I've starting loved new it. friendships. Yeah it definitely helps you to adapt into a more well-rounded human being to have the abilities to obviously live, live by yourself uh, and to be able to function on a daily basis as a human being um, and to have that confidence and to, to grow as a human. Yeah. I agree. Hi, I'm Matt. I'm a final year chemistry student at the University of Greenwich Medway campus. Hi, I'm Kimberly, and I'm a final year chemistry student at the University of Greenwich on the Medway campus.